Yeah, I just want to quickly record this to show that I'm getting 327 miles per hour out of the supercharge right now. It's about 106 kilowatts. You see that? 327. This is probably the highest I've ever got anywhere out of supercharging. And I'm just documenting this because, you know, we're here at the very end of May 2017. I've put about 10,000 miles in the vehicle. And I've heard some reports about how Tesla will reduce your top speed on your supercharging after so many cycles. And it's not that many. I supercharge all the time. So I kind of want to document this, get it on record, showing that I can actually get this type of supercharge now and then you know see what it is in the future and just also for the record it may or may not matter I'm at Glen Allen Virginia just out of, outside of Richmond and I am on 2A if I want to check this out in the future just so, for my own reference so I go back to 2A at, to Glen Allen you know, I don't know five ten years from now I mean I really plan on keeping this vehicle as long as I can so that's why I'm documenting all this so I can kind of see if things change over time with supercharging and if I'm still able to get quick, really, really quick charges on these supercharging stations for Tesla, or if they're gonna start ramping me back dramatically after so many cycles, because I really am going to be using much more frequent supercharging than just about anybody out there. And probably the number of supercharges overall, over the life of this vehicle, as long as it doesn't get wrecked, is probably gonna be one of the highest ever. So I just feel like it's a good idea to document this.